You're watching From the Heart with John Willard. Hi, friends. John Willard here, the gentleman poet. Today, a great show about kindness, a fitting show for Roger Goff, and three poems. And remember the subscribe button below for CNA TV. My opening thought, a word of kindness is seldom spoken in vain. It is treasured by the recipient for life. Clever sayings are as easily lost as pearls slipping from a broken string. It takes many hours to fill a pail of water. If you're doing it, drop by drop. Even when the pail seems full, it can take many drops more. Eventually, of course, one drop more makes the pail overflow. What is good? I ask in musing mood. Order, said the law court. Knowledge, said the school. Truth, said the wise man. Pleasure, said the fool. Love, said the maiden. Beauty, said the page. Freedom, said the dreamer. Home, said the sage. Fame, said the soldier. Equity, the seer. Spoke my heart full Sadly, the answer is not here. Then within my bosom, softly this I heard. Each heart holds the secret. Kindness is the word. Who among us? has not been thrilled by Beethoven's Moonlight Sonata. It captures in sound the glory of a moonlit night, glory that is difficult to, to describe in words. This beautiful piece of music came to be because Beethoven wanted to give something of himself and his talent to a blind girl. He put his genius to work to produce in sound the beauty that in her eyes could not behold. He gave the best of his talent in a selfless act of kindness. As a result, the world has been enriched. No one is useless in this world who lightens the burden of another. When you think of a nice thing to do for someone, don't just think it. Do it. When you have a kind thought, express it. Bring it to life. Put it into action. If you admire something someone has said or done, speak up and say so. You will both be the richer for it. Never be content to think nice thoughts. Express them and do them. Let me share this poem, Appreciate Kindness. He who lives by the side of the road and helps to bear his brother's load may seem to travel lone and long while the world goes by with a merry song. 
but the heart grows warm and sorrows flee when I appreciate you and you appreciate me. It's the greatest thought in heaven or earth. It helps us know our fellow's worth. There be no wars or bitterness, no fear, no hate, no grasping, yes. It makes work play and the care worn free when I appreciate you and you appreciate me. Even the direst catastrophes may be softened by our attitude to them. A man said to those who had gathered about his deathbed, you'll pardon any little lapses, gentlemen. I've never done this thing before. Don't go handing out your troubles to your busy fellow men. If you whine around, they'll try to keep from meeting you again. Be kind. Don't declare the world's again you. Don't let pessimism win you. Prove there's lots of good stuff in you. Be kind. Just go grinning on and bear it. Have you heartache? Millions share it. If you earn a crown, you'll wear it. Be kind. Never let your heart grow bitter with your lips to hope's transmitter. Hear love songbirds bravely twitter. Be kind. Help your brother there who's sighing. Keep his flag of courage flying. Help him. Try. It will keep you trying. Be kind. Friends, my brother-in-law, Roger Golf lost his battle with cancer this month. This appropriate show for Roger, he was kind. We won't say bye to Roger. We just say till we meet again. My closing thought, you cannot do a kindness too soon because you never know how soon it will be too late. Friends, it's time to feed the pups, Cora Mae and Bubba. As always, you can reach me on Twitter at John Willard 47. Until next week, this is John Willard from the farm. <laughs>